Hello everybody, um, welcome to the round of 16 match between Talk 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 and his Chaos Dwarves and Muria and his Lizard Men. In the booth with me is Fymir, hello. Hello, here we are, it's a very rowdy uh, short team with okay bulls, but the rest of the team is uh, very decent. And a team with a super skin and a super croxigo. Yeah, yeah, it's interesting. Very brittle, obviously, Maria's team. He's he's got a wizard and a, and a bear, um super skink. Some, I mean, it's a real nice team, but only eleven men, right? And uh, there's a claw pommer here. There's some mighty blow. The bulls aren't great for uh, talk, talk, talk. But he's got this crazy vampire hobo. It's pretty interesting. Pretty interesting match. Skulls. Yeah, this has got the potential to go really badly for the lizards, hasn't it? If the chops get big hits. Yeah, the thing who's gonna get the best the first uh, card, you know, because the chorus are like, have the same uh, problem than the lizards. If they start losing chorus the team becomes a uh, crap. Yeah, yeah. And like obviously the lizards can just dominate them. Wow. It's hard to get the hits in, right, with a with the claw pommer, especially when you don't try. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a... <laughs> especially when you don't try. Um, but yeah, it's not it's not easy to get those hits in. I used strength five. That was why. So he used the used the dauntless guy to get the two D. But yeah, like that. That's the problem. Like if 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 you're the chosen, you don't make removals. It's just literally hard to two dice people because you know the team is ridiculous. And yeah, only two rerolls. Very TV efficient team. Warriors. It's interesting. I mean, having sure hands on the IG four. Everybody else has block, so you can afford maybe going a little cheap on the rolls, but... Yeah. I would have definitely taken block, by the way, instead of sure hands, but yeah. Oh. Gets wrestled. Oh, baby. That's super interesting. Well, that would be a... A one. The Lisa's will be in massive trouble. Yeah, yeah, it's a huge, huge Crocs activation. Uh, a couple of players. So I like, I like that he's getting all the Saurus in trying to fight, but the problem is. He can get out maneuvered now, yeah, so he goes for the dodge. And they're just a weird team, Lizards. I kind of I used to really like them and now I kinda of don't because it's just they're so weird that like they're so dominate they're like so dominating until they aren't. And <laughs> it's like they just seem really fragile in the the thing is that the, the revenge is always going to be shy. They always mean, you know, it's a, it's a 11 uh, players team. The extra pieces you're going to get, you know, your revenge is going to be uh, little lizards. So it's like... Yeah. I kind of so hate that moving the ball before the blitz, right? Just moving back in the middle. Oh, wow, he's going full, but I hate that. I hate that, getting both balls on the wrong side of the ball. That is risky. Very risky. 
feel like if one, you know, if one bulls in the other half, the other one should definitely be in your hand. In general, like, you know, like, any normal player, it's sometimes difficult to ball, it's different. But, like, you're on defense, like, this this one's this one's really forward. This one's, like, behind everybody on the, on the, on the trough, on the Lizard Man team, isn't he? And then he's behind half of them. Get the power and access the ball is movement five. Oh, can can he? Oh no, he's got sidestep. He can claw on though. Finally. And obviously he has to pile on it. Uh, oh, <laughs> yeah, works beautifully. An instant apple. Gets to hit a skink. And a move, of course, just like Reddit says. <laughs> yes, lucky hit, lucky, lucky hit. Blockless block there. Yeah, but a blockless block. Blockless block in this economy. <laughs> and gets finally gets some cover downfield. Jesus, that was a powerful turn for the charms. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> the the yeah. I wonder if he thought about like trying to surf the uh it's super the it's hard to surf. It's hard to, it's hard to surf. I was thinking he could have surfed the super hobble, but it's it's harder, I guess, because he's strength. Four. But I guess isolating the club. Oh my god! Sorry, isolating the club. I'm like, this is pretty sick. The problem is he's not isolated him right because he's just giving him a hit on the crocs like that. Would, this would have been good if this strength four wasn't there. But he just punch and instantly give a two D on the crocs. An instant 2D on the Crocs. Okay, well, he luckily doesn't get powered. Well, like, if he'd been powered, then you just bring in the other hobo and you instantly 2D. Yeah. You know? yeah, that's like... That was a pretty, a pretty good, pretty lucky. Maria's luck is hanging in so far, isn't it? Yep. Maria's luck is holding. Now he can uh, hit the uh, vampire hobo to get a free source. He can blitz this guy to get another free source. So you can have two free source down for it. He's going over there, fair enough. Yeah, that protects uh, the, the, the frenzy one from the surf. And I guess the ball carry is going to blitz this ball. I don't like doing the uh, crocs. I guess he's got blocked still. It's crazy, yeah, yeah. crazy crocs, guys, isn't it? But still, I think. Crazy crocs. Well, he's not blitzing you. Wouldn't you just blitz through? If, like, if you're putting two over here, because like, this is a big commitment, so you want to try and get as close as possible. There's a break tackle here as well. This seems it, like. That's blotch. Yeah. That was the problem with going over here, like you just can't get there, right? If, even with you blitz with him, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, like even if you blitz with him, you can't you can't get over where these are. I definitely prefer blitzing with him and then getting this guy free. And freeing up this guy. Two free souls. And then stay away from the break of the guy instead of just going straight towards him. Shouldn't, he, Here we um, go, lads. Looks like he stacked these, and obviously he shouldn't have done. That was. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know why the second uh, bull is there. 
because it's going to be only 2D anyway. You can't get 3D. Yeah. Wait, who did this? Prof. Dodge, failed the GFI, use the surfeit. Just did a dodge, just did a dodge. So that was, you know, what he should have done there was, I, I guess he, he stacked it and he shouldn't have done that. He should have done the first dodge and see if he pops and then, break tackle because then he could go another one there, so, but he went all the way around. Oh, and there's the ball carrier ready to come in. Make calls for the dodge. Do you know what? I think if the edge four is not stunned, I think you have to go for the pickup there. I think with him being stunned, you could have he could have just stood above it, right, and have two tackle yeah. zones on it. I'm not saying it would be correct, which is correct, but there's certainly an option to be a bit. I guess he could have been a bit more conservative. Wouldn't have been right or wrong, just a choice. But now, the skin can get away. Without a reroll, might as well because it's unlikely to work. But it does work. Players here. Concede, I guess. I mean, don't as in concede, as in oh, concede. Oh, this time, this time, don't see the oh. right, but sure, if it fails, it goes for the. And then rolls another one. <laughs> in the removal. And uh, knocks out himself, and that's that is right for the. Oh, wow. Wow. Well, that was a pretty diabolical drive for the lizards, but no problem still, and nobody removed. It's actually turned out a great drive for them. Like, it's crazy, isn't it? They, you know, that that went pretty badly, and they still got no one removed, and removed two. And they're going to score on turn eight. I feel like they got in a lot of trouble there. But... With the old instant break tackle 2D on the ball. <laughs> yeah, but no, no. Yeah. Happy days for the lizards. Yeah. The wizard is currently terrifying at Pandora, but there is the double LOS to come for Talk Talk. Tries to surf the stand firm, fails. <laughs> uh, well, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> maybe they were another target, so let's just have another one. <laughs> and happy days for the lizards. But they're halfway there, but they are only 11 men and they do have. The double LOS hits to survive. Correct use of stun film. Wait, what, what, what is this setup? Does he know that it's turn 8? Uh, apparently not. Or maybe it's to prevent like a big foul, right? But. Yeah, maybe it's to try and prevent a big foul. If he thinks that the guys aren't going to... Like, you know, because because the guys he's putting on the LOS aren't that much worse than the guys that aren't on the LOS. 
It's all right. There's less to lose. Like obviously, if you've got really good players, they don't on the LOS. Like you know, if you had like three orc linemen, then obviously put everyone else back. But when everyone's good, I guess. Yeah, put them up there so that okay, you give an extra mighty blow hit. But at least you're uh, protected against the foul. And he's definitely going to foul because he's got he's got a reserve. P did he? Oh, lucky dog! Oh, he's just going in. He's going in. Can he prevent hits completely? Probably not. I guess he can do something. He can make things really, really hard for the chores to get some decent hits. Yeah. Ironically, leaving that guy to be fouled now after after setting up to stop the foul, I would have put the frenzy there because I really would. I would rather a frenzy, the block frenzy, die than just the block. <laughs> It's the pow. And the armor break. Oh. No. And nothing. Oh, Dice. not good, not good. Well, the double LOS is getting survived very well so far. Like to be fair, Talk Talk Talk's team isn't isn't that good, right? He's only pretty much got the claw on that. That's why he's uh, the one giving away the wizard. Like only a wizard, only a wizard, because uh, Murray's got eleven men and two rerolls. So. No, yeah, the bulls are very uh, disappointed, but always that happens when they die. Yeah. Here we go. Mm. Oh, what a pickup! <laughs> yeah. Move three. I imagine I'll try and hand it off at some point. Better than the club on the catching it. Okay, KO works, and that's why I didn't like the the Croxigor on the LOS. You have a block. Lisa. Yeah, it's it's stand firm though, isn't it? So like if he doesn't get it down, like he's gotta put so many players to fight it. And then if he doesn't he can't push it, you know, so if he if he doesn't get it down then um you can use it to get back. So it, it's a hard one, it's a hard one. Obviously. Pros and cons, isn't it? On his course he can't he can't put it on the vampire because of the wizard. So he's gonna have to give it. PC coming here with the elaborated uh, jokes. Deal, what's this? <laughs> um, yeah. Going Almost for like, the skinks? Almost like the team is an internet uh, service provider. I see what you did, Purple Chef. Um, they've both been in Chalice a couple of seasons, Faulty. 
a bit of new kids on the block in a way. They're not like the old vets. Yeah, I know they recognize the names from other uh, challenges and general CCL. Yeah. But I'd still say like more recently than, you know, 20 seasons ago or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Back in a second. The other problem for uh, Talk 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 is he only gets to pile on and then probably got to stand up the next turn, right? So he's only getting half value from his claw pommer. Relies on Dauntless, gets a pile. Disgustous. <laughs> Indeed, peace. Ce joueur préfère se battre entouré. Enemy doit le soutenir. Ces joueurs, ils sont de tous. Ah, si ça continue, le syndicat va les blacklister. Well, that was a nice chain, wasn't it? A nice little chain. Would have got 2D on the ball there. Well, no, 1D because Scott. Not 2D because he could have, he could have run out of the Really nice. And a 1D pow. Hmm. Not sure I like putting that sidestepper on there. It seems a little unnecessary. <laughs> As he happened, he used his players to hit him, so it was okay. God, this is when you don't move, and that's so annoying, aren't you? You've just got, you've just got to push them, just try and beat them off. He's got break tackle. I like putting him to here and dodging him off. Um, right, just in time for the fireball. Yep, a pathetic fireball. I think that wasn't the best. I mean, gives him enough space to. Uh... Yeah, I don't think so. I don't the best defense against the wizard. I think this guy is not strong. You could have just break tackled him out. Maybe you ran out of time. Two tackle zones is still a four plus, isn't it? So not not terrible, but obviously we'll have to put in the reroll. Oh no, he's got sure hands. We'll have to use his sure hand skill. <laughs> <laughs> again, again, another chore there. Magnet hands. Yep, the old magnet hands. God, this is a mess. And he's had some value out this Dauntless, hasn't he? It's so far, unbelievable. Doesn't kill the skink, tragedy. Reddit lied to him. Oh, this one is a big hit. And again, what the hell? Wow. Huge one. Gets the oh. as well. Oh. Oh, that's disgusting. Classic chalk play. <laughs> Imagine if his frenzy was guard instead. But he isn't. Oh, 
glorious. No, I won't nice, give uh, now. until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Plim plom plu, je suis une baguette. <laughs> glorious, thank you very much, Rubinho, BB. Staying fantastic for five glorious months. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hmm. These dwarf catches are funny, aren't they? Oh, surely he's got to give it to the. Uh, surely he's got to give it to the. Uh, yeah, now that the buzzard threat is gone. And just hand it off backwards, can't you? Une bonne chose de fait. I guess wrestles a bit shit for him. But... Yeah, I was thinking that that wrestle is like. Mm. The move is nice. I'm blotch. Yeah, and I guess yeah, blotch instead of no defensive skills is pretty big, isn't it? And he does have the break tackle, so it's not as if he can't hit you. Si le joueur trébuchant du terrain, il finira dans les tribunes. Et connaissant les fans de Blood Bowl, ce serait une très mauvaise idée pour lui. He's got to dodge this. Uh... Wow. Frenzy trap. Yeah. That works. Frenzy trap before moving his super skink away seems pretty bad. Now he gets it safe. Three times left for the charge, but I think they, they can make it. Yeah, I guess that actually that's probably the best reason to hand off to the move guy, isn't it? Because you get into the point where you don't have to make a move. And it might be a bit shit. So having that extra move. Obviously this was going to be the blitz. Wow, doesn't get the knockdown. Maybe you should have re-rolled that. Because... He really re-rolls before going out. Nah, he's going to get more hits. I mean... Yeah, but like, but he's got to go. He's got to go, hasn't he? So you know, if he if he powered him there, then that guy gets forward. He punches him, and then he, he moves him like here, which is pretty nice. I guess break tackling is okay, but I would have much preferred like to have the ball here in a cage instead of over here, not in a cage. Five two two for two D, but he hasn't got. He hasn't got a track as he's one, two, three, four, five, six, two, five, two, five, oh, coming in with a strength three. Fishing for pounds. Mm. That's a problem, isn't it? Two doing the ball, can even seem that good, due to the fact he's got power. I mean, with a uh, reroll, it's around a 50%, so it's yeah. worth the effort. Oh, Especially yeah. if it wins you, wins you the game. I mean, if the Chorus lose the ball there, yeah. they run out of movement to score on early. Yeah. Not killing this king, another mistake. Full play. Yep, yep. Alright, makes the one in nine dodge. I haven't got a lot of cover with him. Bull's glorious, glorious return to relevancy. Probably should have made the extra one to tag that break tackle. Ultimately. Oh, he's already tagged, okay. Nothing. 
Oh, I like that. I like the GFI attack, but yeah. Yeah, I'm yeah. Sure. Good effort, good reward. And seems this is uh, taking a oh, yes. a path towards the Overtime, very easy score here, just uh, move the ball, the ball to cover the score in front of the ball carrier. Yeah. Hit with the Gressel uh, strength of four for uh, 2D. How uh, any push or Gressel, the other, uh, the Hobo can just uh, score easy. It's yep, instant. Instant. Okay, this is, this is all the way of doing it, but yeah, yeah, it was easy, it was easy to, yeah. to get the... Yeah, he knew his serves and so he couldn't sidestep into the, the other way, so yeah, it was, it was super easy to play. Yeah. So here we go. Maybe over time? Maybe a one turn for the Wizards? Oh, but Chaos come back, that's massive for the Lizard. It's unbelievable, they've taken like hardly any damage. The Chorps have been hitting the Lizards turn after turn, but yeah. Mm -hmm. He does have a few stand for. But still, I feel like this. You know, with the ad with the uh, side step, and you could even put the edge one on this on the line, you know, and then you lose. Obviously, you lose sh sure hands, but the edge four dodges and the side step is pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, so he's going. He is going for that. So you've got to power the guy in the middle, and then use the whole method on the ball center. I think we're going to see uh, the frenzy uh, piece doing some work here. Yep. Yeah, it's a good point. Good point, Yudi, with a two stand firm. Yeah, probably should have had no, no gap. These are the guys behind. But okay, then... abso <laughs> absolutely nothing worked. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was. I guess it doesn't matter if your opponent rolls like this. <laughs> it's, it's like complete disaster of uh, LOS. <laughs> okay, let's go for two overtime. <laughs> Relevant hobble comes back. Allez, on y retourne, les gars. C'est reparti pour le massacre. Un joueur de moins, c'est facile à remplacer. Oh wow, the lizards win the toss. Well, don't say it's over. But now the Toros have a very big problem here. It's pretty much over, isn't it? The, the, the skins are the skins are lining fast, so yeah. only one man down as well, and he's got strength three and four skins. It's gonna take some dice, dice failing to get talk, talk, talk back in this. He could actually start removing people, but even then, like it's just gonna be too fast for the. Like, how do you even stop the skin scoring? I guess there's tackles. It's tricky, very tricky for the Chorus. 
stand firm on the wings. And I guess I would have had both balls in the centre. Oh, the edge four, right? the strength for edge four. But then I guess if you put the edge strength for edge four on the outside, then he uh, gets blitzed. You'd rather be blitzed the. And right now the wrestle uh, strength four is better than the bull with no skills. Yeah, he kind of is. Yeah. But the problem is he, he, they're gonna have to blitz that one. Oh wow! Oh, well, that helps, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a very nice result. Uh, the. Imagine not defending against the blitz at all. Everyone who criticises the Dakar and say just score in two, this is what can happen when you just try and score in two, right? You did all this to give him the best chance to push through, but unfortunately we have to open over here. The rookie ball. Let's see. Here comes the big lad. Guess you re-roll here because you've got four. Yes. And and like fuck equity, you have to. You know, you're on defense. You have to spend them all getting the getting the draw of the win now. I wonder if you blitz the blitz the vamp and then try to uh, you know try to roll some dice with the edge four. It's a three plus uh, right now for the edge four with his sure hand, so yeah. It might make it better to just blitz the vamp, the hobgoblin, the vampire hobgoblin. Is he blitz at all this turn? Doesn't blitz at all, has he? No. Could have, uh, could have put that guy in here and blitz the blitz the hobble. Oh wow! Well, then that frees up the libo. Knock him down. Whack in the ball. I guess the brave tackle isn't actually that good, is it? In the you could just run around with a rookie. God, I'm gonna have to have a lie down and, and scream the ball. <laughs> Might be just enough for the lizards to escape. Oh, oh the bone head, head finally, finally happens after all these uh, turns, mm. and this could be the worst probably turn to happen. Yeah, right. Didn't like that he hasn't made good use of the vampire on defense. No, also I think the having the you know the, the piece that has us at the back is nice but he can't stop by skink the you know yeah, there's gonna be one dice. I mean while the uh, AG4 uh, strength four can take it with wrestle hands to wrestle can take care of uh, any skink. Yeah, yeah. Or any lizard. 
I guess it's one in three because it hasn't got block, so it's not too bad if he has to one beam, but yeah, I probably should have tried to have a vampire or uh, the vampire hobo or the uh, bull. Let's back a little bit for safety. We're still in, still getting turned around here. It still doesn't re-roll, man. Oh my god, you have to re-roll that. How on earth do you not re-roll that? Jesus. Does this guy, I think the strength 5 guy blitzes here. Either he blitzes or the frenzy blitzes. One of those two has to blitz and get down. Yeah. The problem with the uh, frenzy is he needs the power, doesn't he? Whereas he could have done it with just a flash. Interesting times. Oh yeah, one in three, not one in nine. God. You can tell I'm tired. Ball can hit the ball here, can't it? Yeah. If he gets the power, which he does. It's only a one of those, yeah, so he's got to commit him first. But at least it pays off having a guy back there. Yeah, yeah, no, no. Having a guy at the back is always good. And now here he comes. Gets the power. Gets the power. Gets the armor break. And the cast. Wow, the follow, though. Ooh, that's a brave. Oh! <laughs> the ball in the middle. Mm. Rookie ball trying to. Rookie, oh my god, oh! <laughs> okay, now that's anybody's game. Yeah, it is. I mean, well, it's looking more like the shorts, isn't it? This is amazing, and they've really not done a lot until recently. I mean, I don't see what the lizards do. Oh god, they need the croc splits. You get it. No, they don't. Oh, alone and fail. Fool. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, yeah, maybe the crux wasn't activated last turn. Oof, big mistake if that was the case. Be honest, I kind of fell asleep a few times during that match. <laughs> no. All carrier free. Coming in. He's gonna pick up with the. What's <coughs> it? With the A4. Yeah. Yeah. Get, the, get the one. I like that, it just makes it harder to get the, hit, the rando hitting from like a thing. <laughs> Doesn't have a screen here. Which is interesting, isn't it? So it's a 5 plus to 2D the ball? Yep. 5 plus with a reroll is a 50%. He doesn't have a reroll though. Oh, this yeah, is... that's true. I was looking at the other team. <laughs> Straight 33 though. And then he doesn't, you know, he doesn't have defensive skill. So he's like 25% to get the ball here. Doesn't even try. Okay, well he does it with the one with him. I guess that works. In fact, it's kind of better because he's got friends. Like, I just thought of dodging with a strength 5 because he's strength 4. And he gets it on the frenzy hit. Oh my god. The frenzy one day, and he catches oh. it on the strength five. Ah, huh. well, so that's, everything was planned. That's how the lizards can get back into it. <laughs> okay, here comes. You can take the push here, can't you? Get hit Ooh. with a hobo. He's not hitting with a hobo. Oh God. I guess he's out of range, so it doesn't even need to hit him again anyway. Wow, 
I would sure like to get the push in and hit him again with strength 3. Maybe he didn't have enough assists to get the 2D. Okay, now it comes a massive Crox activation. <laughs> it works, and that guard. Looks like Murray. Murray might just be battling for kicks here, eh? and he's got a two disadvantage, so not looking good. Not only is the bonus, Soros is bonus strength five, Soros, giving him half a chance. Just like Christerberg. <laughs> yeah, just blitz him and then you get two D afterwards, don't you? Probably. Joffs do indeed have the kick equity, but I still think it's all you can do, right? Is the lizards like? You can't try and score in that situation, you've just got to try and hang on. Yep, gets the push to try and dodge out for the ball carrier. Here we go. Dodge. Oof. Works. Tail no Big the ball. Right, so another five plus to hit the ball. But he does have block, so it'll be a little bit more difficult to get it this time. Might also just want to put a skink in the way first. I think it's maybe this, this because this skink had like the one in nine dodge, right? So maybe he's going to put the skink in first. Yeah. And now the hobo needs to run for his life. I think it was too hard, you'd, you'd look at maybe you thought about it, but like there's a stand firm there, isn't there? And there's like, there's so much, uh, so few players for the Lizards. Uh, I mean, maybe you did look at it, but it looked, it looked difficult to try and chain the sword or so. But who knows, maybe, maybe you looked at it. Couldn't figure it out, and maybe, maybe it was possible. Maybe it wasn't. But it wasn't. It wasn't easy, was it? Another frenzy trap. No, it's not a frenzy trap. God, it's the, it was the Saurus that frenzy trapped himself, wasn't it? He's the yep. Dauntless. The Dauntless guy was great, honestly. The Dauntless guy got so I, much value. Well, you know, when they have so many uh, normal skills, Dauntless is fine. Mm. I mean, what else? We are gonna give a chart with uh, all. Uh, Normal and strength. Yep. At least having one, you know. Ooh, and I think that's uh, that's it. It is, yeah. What a crazy, crazy uh, game! What a crazy overtime. Very entertaining. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was really good, wasn't it? You know, it kind of sucks for Maria, but like, that's the nature of lizards, isn't it? And Claude, I mean, he actually had really good chances. It took a long time for the claw to kick in. And, uh, and even then, it didn't that much, did it? Right? It was just it was just two skinks that were uh, cast out on the thesaurus. So yeah, just all that mighty blow and barely did anything. Um, right. Well, there you go. Uh, congratulations, talk, 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 commiserations, Maria. Thank you very much, Fimeer, as always. Absolutely glorious. It's always a pleasure to be here, and the chores progress to the next stage of the Chalice Cup. Yep. Thanks for watching everyone, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.